stay strong and get it done. Hello! We are from the music industry. I would like, today needs to be preceded by a preamble of sorts. All right, first of all, this dude came up to me and said there are gonna be three cameras on you while you're playing, and he's a fucking lion at all, and I'm terrified. Uh, that's number one. That's the that's the preamble to the preamble. This is the preamble as previously advertised. Um, this is the Bring Your Own Band tour, and if you guys don't know us, um, we encourage people um, who don't get to play with bands that much or who wanted to play to come here with a guitar or a keyboard or a bass or whatever and come play our songs if they know them. Our friend Josh showed up today with a full drum set. So, everybody already gave it up for Josh. Let's give it up even louder for Josh. And let's hope he doesn't fuck up, right? This song is called Blow Your Brains Out on Live Television. And uh, Josh, uh, I guess just click it out with a bop, 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 bop. to know them in five seconds because it goes congratulations whoa, whoa and nice going asshole and it goes like this <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna 
Um, can we get more vocals and guitar in the drum wedge? Or is that what it's called? I don't know what things are called. Big plans. So, is everybody enjoying South Carolina as much as I'm enjoying South Carolina? Don't answer before you know how much I'm enjoying South Carolina. Quite a bit. All right, bad, bad. Well, some of them float, some of them sing. This song is about meeting somebody who tells you that it's okay to stay inside all day and drink alcohol and stay in bed and not answer your phone calls. It's called Big Plans of Sleeping In. Uh, It's tough. 
<laughs> Josh, are you ready for the tough one? Yeah. He's like, these are 10 minute rock opera. It's called Armenian Idiot. It's our dedication to a uh, system of a down. Get the jokes. Green Day. It, Grammy Award winning Green Day. Have you guys heard this? No? No? Okay. Uh, anyway, um, this song is about a boss of mine that I used to have a little while ago. One day I showed up to work and I found out that he ran away on a crack binge using the company debit card. This is a completely true story. And um, over the next three or four months, the owners started coming in, not the managers. And they were talking about how this is all a family and we're all in this together and not to worry, but that they'd be giving us pay cuts and that they didn't have, know any of our names, which I mean, I, I know my family members' names, right? So um, shortly, where'd my bass go? Oh, this is hand. Thanks. It got unplugged because I rocked so fucking hard I'm, just I'm, standing here talking. I'm on unemployment because of this whole situation, so, so I don't really give a fuck. They, see, they didn't even tell me we could get unemployment. This is besides the point. The point is, bosses suck, especially when they run away on crack binges. This song is called Dude Get With The Program and be forgiving on the bass because I'm not very good. Uh, and sing the words if you know them. And thanks a lot. We are Blom the Bluesic Blinders to play. Thank you. 
fired. You're laid off, you could be fired. And we don't really care. Yeah, it's a party! Say Balladry Mafia for booking this show. Josh is gonna leave me alone right now. We just got back from tour a couple of days ago. This is their first local show. Thanks. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do the banter in your set too. Doyle's in the back called The Fad and they're wonderful and they're playing after us. And they play before us every night so I get to watch them and drink beer tonight. So I'm excited. And you should be excited too because they're great. Uh, all right, this song has a bunch of beats in it and uh, a bunch of words in it, and it's about having a panic attack on the Staten Island Expressway and thinking about how shitty your life is when you work in a basement. But guess what? It's all right, because then you write songs and everything's better. This song uses the iPod. See, that was real uh, smooth of me. That was my, what's the word I'm looking for? Discreet banter? All right, can someone say dance party? I can say dance party. Can you guys say dance party? Dance I... party! All right, man. I hope you feel that in your heart, because it's about to be a dance party up in this motherfucker, son. It was a hot you day. My ass was taking a seat my girl was gone. Get the fuck with it, give to your fun for a bus out of capacity to get to get under 90 degree day in New York. And yeah, 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 you're gonna drive over five hours of traffic to get 90 degrees for a dream, you're gonna have to make a fun day, spin the ride, you're gonna have to make a fun day, fuck.
are. You might fan your amplifier and tell the kids with a straight face for a short microphone and JBL speakers that corporate rock is for suckers. Uh, yeah. Curves, right? Yeah. And uh, <laughs> when I'm not playing and buying the music industry, I play six or five instruments at the same time, and I go under the pseudonym the Matt Curse One, which is pretty clever, right, guys? So we're, we're gonna cover me now and do a Bond the Music Industry song, version of one of my songs that's about uh, I guess if you kids are a little younger, you'll find out you're gonna move away from your hometown. You're gonna be like. Woohoo! I'm gone. Unfortunately for me, I moved from Long Island, and everyone in the world uh, hates Long Islanders, including Long Islanders. So I get a lot of shit for it, right? So this one is about being defensive about a place that you could give two shits about. Just cause like, I guess when someone else talks about your mom, you're like, yo, that's my mom. Even if she's like on crack, you know, she's still your mom. Ready? This song is called Long Island, I swear. Yeah. download my album and Jeff's album for fucking free, son, on quote, unquote, records.com. So, like, the coolest bands in the country are giving their shit away for free? Check it out, son, you got nothing to lose. Damn. We got two more songs left. This is one of those two songs. Your cheat sheet's over there. Over there. It's blowing cheat sheets all over the place. So, this is a song, um, unlike the other ones, which were pictures. I saw that joke from a live recording of Adam and his package, and I thought it was the funniest thing I'd ever heard, and apparently nobody else thinks that but me. Like, I ripped somebody off, and it didn't even go over well. Uh, right. Game of two seconds. Oh, just talk more about the things. Donations, good things. Oh. 
Oh yeah, uh, so we don't, we're like the PBS of punk rock right now, I guess. Like, if you really dig the stuff and you wanna, yeah, <laughs> that kid's implying, yeah, if you wanna dig the stuff and you wanna give us some dough so that we can live, that's awesome. But if you don't like it, then uh, whatevs. And if you do like it and you ain't got no money, whatevs, just take it, we don't give. So, uh, if you want shirts, take one off your back and we'll make one for you outside for free. But, uh, you know, PBS, if you give us some money, you'll get like, a, I don't know, the tote bag or whatever. So, so come get our stuff. I got shirts with my face on them. That's pretty neat. Okay. <laughs> All right. Da dance to the summer, people. All right. This song, I need, I'm going to be playing the sax, so I need, you guys are on the honors to clap on the offbeat. So, we got to try, so I'm going to be the pretend bass drum right now. Okay, cool. All right, we got it. This is fucking, this is, fuck band members. <laughs>
Thanks. I work really hard. You can't have a four minute song without a fake ending. That's not gonna happen, I'm sorry. I know, come on, right? We're a bunch of jerks. We only have one more song left. Somebody came up to us and said they would kick our asses if we uh, played anymore. It's true. That's not true. All right, you want me to tell you the truth? It's not on the fucking iPod. We can't play it. I'm sorry. <laughs> this is our last song of the night. Uh, it goes out to the sound guy. This is the first night on the tour that we've actually been able to hear ourselves, and that's completely sound true. Guy. So right. seriously, <laughs> give it up for him. It's a hard job. This song is called <clears throat> Life is Great. <laughs> Wait, can we do a really rock and roll intro now that we have a drummer? Just hit the cymbals a lot of shit. If you motherfuckers are ready to rock, say hell yeah! You should join Iron Maiden. I said I don't love the rock tonight. Watch it go, man. What a rush away. <laughs> the sun in my guitar, and I knew what you were doing yesterday. <laughs> you broke those promises. I'll get over it. As long as I'm breathing fresh air, I really don't give a shit. So keep back for the next eight years, man. Real life sucks. Things are great. I did it. After I I had it.
it up one more time real loud for Josh. It's all free, baby. Leave your t-shirts at the merch table. previously advertised. Um, this is the Bring Your Own Band Tour, and if you guys don't know us, um, we encourage people um, who don't get to play with bands that much or who wanted to play to come here with a guitar or a keyboard or a bass or whatever and come play our songs if they know them. Our friend Josh showed up today with a full drum set. So, Everybody already gave it up for Josh. Let's give it up even louder for Josh. And let's hope he doesn't fuck up, right? This song is called Blow Your Brains Out on Live Television. And uh, Josh, uh, I guess just click it off with a bop, 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 bop. Um, can we get more vocals and guitar in the drum wedge, or is that what it's called? I don't know what things are called. So, is everybody enjoying South Carolina as much as I'm enjoying South Carolina? Don't answer before you know how much I'm enjoying South Carolina. Quite a bit. All right, bad, bad. Well, some of them float, some of them sink. This song is about meeting somebody who tells you that it's okay to stay inside all day and drink alcohol and stay in bed and not answer. Yeah, 
because it goes congratulations, whoa, whoa, and nice going, asshole, and it goes like this.